Hello guys, welcome to my first video of this year. Um, so today um, I will be talking about tools that I use um, to increase my productivity, uh, to boost my productivity, strong level, you know. So um, basically, um, I use um, three tools, actually. Um, the first one is Switch, um, the second one is Fig. And the third one is rectangle. So um, I'm going to walk you guys through these three tools that have made my life so productive as a developer. And yeah, let's get started. So um, switch. Um, let's start with um, fig. Um, so um, fig is um a tool. Fig is a tool that um. Uh, that provides intelligence for your um, for your terminal so uh, it's like um it's like adding an auto auto complete to your terminal so um with that it automatically into when you type code you know when you are typing your terminal commands um for example you can see this um this um demo also let me pull up my yes good real quick i can say type ls and you can see the automatic suggestions you know yeah so that's what fig does it has a lot of autocomplete feature let me, let me check my log yep so that's what fig does so fig provides um autocomplete for your terminal sessions it works with any kind of terminal be it um item um vs code terminal or your terminal app yeah um so fig works with all these um with all these um terminals to demonstrate for this purpose um i'll bring my terminal to the view i order uh, item terminal um just a second yeah here is it and yes you can see that uh you can see that um, we have um Fig also working on this terminal section. So uh basically fig is easy to use. What you just need to do is uh to download and install um fig and there you and there you go. There's nothing too there's nothing too complicated about using fig. And um you can contribute to like adding an um, autocomplete. Um so uh, it, maybe like for example, I don't I'm not aware if um uh, if um if um yt downloader that has a figure to complete um obviously it seems it doesn't have so um if i will, i am less busy i can um kind of write um in the auto complete specification for yt downloader then create a pull request on fixed repo so that it can be merged, merged and um we have auto completes for white downloader so yeah so um fig is a very awesome tool and yeah you guys should definitely try it out yeah <laughs> so the next tool on the list actually is switch up uh, uh, one more thing about fig fig is only supported on mac os that's a bummer but yeah it's only a mac os supported uh, application so yeah so the next um app is switch switch app so basically switch app um, switch app is um is a app that allows you to bind um key commands to opening apps or switching between apps so um it's available for windows and mac os here is the mac os version so you press command option then one two or whatever stuff you are signed on you know to kind of use switch so um and it's only also available on the windows platform too um yeah here's the windows version so um i will use the mac version and by the way i'm the developer i'm the author of switch i was on that created switch so um switch allows you to like bind commands to um apps to commands so um let me let me demonstrate the usage of switch real quick uh so um Hold on. Uh, 
Yeah, shit. Um, so before I demonstrate the the usage of switch, let me download Killcaster. Um, a Killcaster. Um, a like keyboard visualization tool for macOS, so you guys can see um what I'm up to. <laughs> so um, real quick. Let me download this guy. I'm going to use Brew to download it, and uh, as I'm done downloading it, uh, you will see, you'll be able to see what um what I'm typing on my screen, and um yeah, that will properly help us explain what um what Switch is doing or it provides to you as a productivity tool. So basically, while this thing is downloading, Switch allows me to switch between multiple apps very fast with my keyboard. If you notice, I'm swap switching between um, my VS Code and my browser tab easily, stress-free, without using command tab or any other thing, because I'm I've bind these apps to a specific key com combination. So with those key combination, I can keep switching um, the apps. So yeah. So that's what um switch does in a nutshell uh let me check if oh yeah kickstar is successfully installed so uh, let me kind of open it Yippee. um i'm setting kickstar earth um so bear with me Um, okay, let me relaunch the app real quick. Okay, um, let me set um, stuff real quick. Nice. Cool. So, uh, yeah, cool, cool, cool. So we can see um, all what I'm typing. Um, let me, let me, let me configure it a little bit. Uh, -huh. uh, hold on, cool, 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 cool. Yeah. So um, I have switch installed on my computer, right? So if I press the command option, the um tick it shows um, my switch tree my switch dock so these are the um apps that i've assigned um the first app is um visual i'm um, sorry brief second app is visual studio and the third app is my figma apparently i have nothing assigned to my um spotify um to my to my fourth app so um, i might shift my spotify to this guy up um, i mean i use my terminal all the time so i can move my terminal via the spotify to this and um, yep so um so with that if i press command option one it switch to brave command option two is switched to um vs code command option three is switched to like um, um figma command option four opens by um my item then five opens by spotify so yeah you see how easy it is to be switching between windows easily so yeah that's what switch does and um you can configure like like i've shown earlier you can configure your app you can you know you can search for new apps say you want to like um add um what app do i use frequently say i want to um maybe um kind of uh let me look for a app real quick um 
Mm -hmm. Maybe I want to add um, Discord. But I can drag my Discord here over here, then that's Discord is already added. So therefore, um, to switch to Discord, that will be Command Option Six to switch to my Discord app. So apparently, my Discord app is not yet opened. So that will that will take a while for it to launch. <laughs> yeah, and that's what Switch does. Switch helps me to um switch between apps easily. So with that. I can automatically switch between apps up and imagine I'm working on um, a front-end project that I need to be checking, cross-checking my Figma design and uh, open my code, then open my browser tab. So this repetitive task, I can do it simultaneous, like almost instantly, so free. So that's what um, Switch helps me to achieve. And um, Switch has been a very indispensable tool ever since I've launched it and um, yeah on product hunt you guys can um you know <laughs> you can you can uh, you cannot vote it on product hunt and yeah and make sure to download switch so switch is available for both um switch is available for both windows and mac os yeah so let me play the the stuff for you. Yeah, cool. So yeah, I mean you can watch the reel on YouTube. Um, so you, you have maybe another a, be, a better understanding of what Switch does. <laughs> yep. So and that's it. So the next app is Rectangle rectangle app so uh oopsie it seems my, like my internet is a bit slow but uh, we'll take that <laughs> so um rectangle app um, is 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 actually yeah i'll go and pause this so rectangle app is um is actually um an app that i used to like manage my you know my window screens so um, I can resize my window screens because I'm, I'm using an ultra wide screen. Um, sorry, um, a 34 inch screen. It's a bit long. So um, I use rectangle to kind of um, um, you know, switch between these um to kind of um, size them on um, on the screen so that I can place my pre browser to one side and easily place um my other window to other side so um i use switch to manage this this stuff so um that's what i use switch to do so um <laughs> that's cool so yeah basically that's those are the three apps that i use every day you know in my day-to-day -day, um development stuff um i hope you guys learned one of the things um don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and um give this video a, video a thumbs up if you like it um i'm, I'm, kind, of, I'm kind of um having idea shot to it i mean i don't know what to um post or what to like if it, to make video about um if you have anything in mind you can definitely um write out uh, write it out in the comment section i would take a look at it and um, i'll probably make a video about whatever you guys ask so other than that <laughs> yeah peace